and the full size price of this is $38. So I would really, 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 really have to like this product to pay $38 for it. But yeah, you can definitely uh, try it and then determine if it's something that you want to put that kind of um, money on. Maybe to some people it's not a big deal, but for me, $38 is kind of a lot, but <laughs> that's just my opinion. Hello ladies, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, my name is Michelle. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We love us some new people over here. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for clicking on the link when you saw this and thank you for hitting the notifications bell so that you knew exactly when I was going to release another video. Now today I'm doing something different, something I've never done on my channel before and I'm really excited about it. Today I'm going to be reviewing and unboxing a beauty box. Now the box I'm going to be unboxing is Ipsy. Now for those of you who do not know, Ipsy is a beauty a subscription service that delivers curated beauty products right to your door. Now Ipsy has three levels of glam bags. They have just a regular glam bag, which is $12 a month, $12 US. They have a glam bag plus, which is $25 US, and they have a glam bag X, which is $50 Quarterly. Now, because I live in Canada, I unfortunately do not have access to the other two glam bags. I just have access to the one that is for $12, which makes me a little sad. I'm not going to lie because I've seen other YouTubers out there that are reviewing those bags and the products in there look absolutely amazing. So I would have really liked to have had the opportunity to try those products. But nonetheless, we are going to move forward and we are going to talk about the bag that I subscribed to. Two. Now, the way that Ipsy works in terms of determining what products they're going to send to you is that you do a beauty quiz. Now, the beauty quiz will have you answering questions about your hair color, your eye color, your skin tone, the type of skin you have. Is it dry? Is it oily? What products do you use and how often do you use those products? And then from that, they are able to curate these uh, products. They also ask you questions like, you know, do you like bold colors? or more muted colors. So what you're getting is really, really personalized to suit your taste. Okay, so now that we have all of that out of the way, let's get into what I got in my first glam bag from Ipsy. First of all, when your glam bag comes, it comes in this really beautiful packaging. Like Ipsy could have just gone ahead and put this in like a white bubble wrap envelope or like a brown bubble wrap envelope. But no, Ipsy decided to send it off in this really cute pink envelope. It has Ipsy on the front. It also says discover yourself and again, Ipsy there. So I like this extra added touch. It makes you feel extra special when you get this in the mail on a monthly basis. So kudos to Ipsy for going the extra mile and really branding this really, really nicely. Now, when your products come, they come in a, a little cosmetic bag. This is for the glam bag that I'm reviewing today. I'm not exactly sure how the products come in the other two bags, if they come in glam bags, if they come in like tote bags, but the regular glam bag that we are looking at today comes in a cosmetic bag. <laughs> So this is what the bag looks like. Really cute, really nice quality um, cosmetic bag. This is the one for June. It does have the rainbow on it, which is definitely a nod to pride. It also has a rainbow on the zipper and a really nice uh, brightly colored tab here. Now within the bag, you are going to get a little card like this. And this card will tell you about the theme of the month. So every month there is a different theme and the bags will look different as well, the cosmetic bags, as well as the products, obviously. But you will get this in your cosmetic bag. So the theme for June was do you bold moves only this month, amp up everything that makes you happy, glitter liners, rainbow accents, and celebrate the beauty that comes from being you. So I really love that message. Inside you will find all of the products that are contained within the bag. You would have gotten this as well in an email from them. So they send you an email, it shows all the products that they chose for you. I got my bag about 10 days after getting that email. So I really like this, really love the messaging. Now we are going to get into the bag. 
So the first product is this IBY eyeshadow in the color a cinnamon roll. It is a metallic eyeshadow. Um, it is a cream eyeshadow, so they say that it should minimize um, a fallout. This is what the product looks like. So it's a very nice, like, shimmery, metallic eyeshadow. Definitely something that I would gravitate to. The sample size is, is nice as well. It's about the size that would be in a palette. And the full size of this will cost you $20. But you'll be able to get a few uses out of this in order to determine if it's something that you actually want to purchase. Now, the second item is the Seraphine Primer. This is what the packaging looks like. And it has pink guava in it. It's oil-free, illuminating primer. And that's what it actually looks like. So this you can get a couple of uses out of. I really like the size of this. You can probably get, what, two to three uses out of it before you determine if it is a product that you are going to spend your money on and purchase. And the full size of this is $42. Now, the third product that I got in my beauty bag was this concealer here. Let me flip it around for you there. It's by Pretty Vulgar. That's the name of the company. It is in the shade 65. This you can probably get two to three uses out of as well, and it does retail for $24. The fourth item was this Mercy Handy Hand Cream in Dolce Vita. This is a really nice size, especially just to carry around in your purse. You'll definitely be able to sample this more than a few times in order for you to determine if you want to buy it. If you do want to purchase it the full size, I think it's really well priced. It is a $7, but that's what it looks like. Now the last product in my beauty bag is a product that I definitely um, was running short on. So I'm really happy that I got it in my bag. It is the Mazzy Balancing Multi Effect Cleanser. That is what it looks like right there. This you can probably get like two or three um, good uses out of it in order to determine if you want to purchase it. And the full size price of this is $38. So I would really, 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 really have to like this product to pay $38 for it. But yeah, you can definitely uh, try it and then determine if it's something that you want to put that kind of um, money on. Maybe to some people it's not a big deal, but for me, $38 is kind of a lot. But <laughs> that's just my opinion. But there you go. There it is. Okay, so that is it for my Ipsy Beauty bag that I got this month. I'm really happy with the whole process in terms of being able to do the quiz because from that they sent me products that I actually really like. They didn't send me anything that I'm kind of like, oh, why did they send this to me? Like, I'm not going to use it. So I really liked the whole process. I liked that I got an email before it shipped out to me, letting me know what products were going to be contained in my bag. Love the packaging. Love the really cute packaging. Like that might not mean a lot to some some people but for me I really appreciated that they went the extra mile and really packaged it nice I love the cosmetic bag you can even keep those extra cosmetic bags and say if you want to give someone some cosmetics at Christmas or for a birthday that is a really great little package to put it into so all in all I really enjoyed my ipsy bag I actually just got my July bag as well so I'm really excited to open that because I do see some products in there that I am in need of so overall I would definitely give my whole experience a 10 I really enjoyed it I like the products I will use the products let me know if there are other beauty subscription boxes that you think I should try are there ones that you think are better than ipsy what is your experience with ipsy I would love to hear about it from you so that is it for the video today i hope you enjoyed it please do connect with me over on instagram at michelle's underscore bell underscore v i do post on there when i will be releasing new youtube videos so if you want a bit of a heads up or just could or just to connect with me more regularly please do head over there please like Please subscribe, please comment, please share if you'd like to support me. I really, really appreciate it. And please do go ahead and check out some of my previous videos. I did put out two She In Haul videos that you might enjoy. I will leave the link right here. So till next time, thank you for spending a few minutes out of your day with me. Have a blessed day. Bye.